Um, and that's going to be tough to win a game against Slovenia if that's where you're forced to play your offense. Doncic going baseline. Nice cut and timing by Toby. Just waited. Doncic again. Comes back, steps back, takes the three, count it. And you can't criticize the defense. Nice. So has done absolutely everything you would ask. Doncic in the post, going to work down low. Backs in inside that Toby again with his third three. This time he makes it. You know, they've got a lot of confidence in stretching the floor at the five. And able to collect himself and find the space. Doncic trying to hold for the last one. Off the glass for two. Too big, too strong. And I think the Carrera absence is more worrying for Venezuela. 53 to 41. Doncic through traffic for two. Oh, what a move. Just puts Chario on skates as he goes to the basket. And look at this play. Steps in, puts the brakes on, puts the skids on Chario and gets the score. Chirio will be saying, no, that, that's that final advertising. People slip on it all the time. <laughs> Doncic uh, just went through contact three or four times throughout the move and ends up with a really soft touch and finish. And a good timeout by Coach Giro. Gets out to a 14-point lead. He doesn't like what he sees. Maybe playing in the fourth quarter today. Steps back, lines up the three, drops it. Just signature, Luca. Doncic on a pick and pop. Puts it on the floor, steps back for a tough three. Oh, oh my goodness me. Audible, right? Yeah. That's the point where, as a defender, you're going, there is almost nothing. Luka Doncic, who will advance the basketball. Muric will get it back to Luca. And one. As simple as that. Ages, I think the Venezuelan resolve is gradually eroding. They've put absolutely everything they can into this qualifying tournament. But they've just come up against, well,